it. There's nowhere to my right that's too far to the right, and I just let it go there. Okay, John, so I've had a bit of a think about where I'd like to go next, because I could go in about three or four different directions. It's, it's looking really good, but we still can sharpen it up in multiple ways. One of the ways we can do that is in, is in you understanding that you don't have to change the direction. So this is one of the fundamentals, okay? One of the fundamentals is that the club relative to the player, not the camera, but relative to the player, I might get you to come over here, John, so I don't clock you in the head. Relative to the player, the club is going to do a, a, an orbit in one direction, just like a comet goes in one direction around the sun. Just keeps going in one direction. Of course, if you were far enough away from our solar system and galaxy and whatever and were watching it, you go, oh, it's going two ways. It's going away from the sun and going toward the sun. But it's really just one never direction. never changes its direction. Okay. So that's the, that's the concept here. And so we want to go more in one direction than you are now. And be like, well, you, you're probably wondering, how am I, how am I altering that? So, here, here. So I unfold, and it keeps going from here. At the point where it's, it's most unfolded, it doesn't stop and come back. It keeps going away, mm. okay? And we want to get that. Now, you're short-circuiting that just slightly, and this is how. This is why we don't have to change direction, by the way. My palm is facing away from the camera, below my elbow. When I lift my palm up above my elbow, it's now facing the camera. So just by the nature of having my hands go from folded to unfolded, I'm already getting my anatomy to completely turn over relative to the camera. And so when you see that, we think as golfers that we have to create some change there. I want you to stay in your cross you stay in your cross and let the club turn it over. Now it's still crossed at the second crossroads. It's still crossed. Yep. It's just that the things that were on one road have been taken to the other road by the club and the things that were on the other road have changed to the other road. So now you just crossed up on the other side. But you didn't have to make the turn. The club has achieved that and your anatomy has achieved that from folded over with the club outside me to unfolded in the club inside me, do I need any more change than that? Okay, that's all the change I need. So I will, we I need to keep, extrapolate on this. Yeah. Because that's that's a key, mate. Yeah, yeah. That's whew. well, I'll hit one. But here's the thing. So this this is the simple version. Okay, palms behind me. Okay, mm. palms in front of me palms behind me, palms in front of me. I didn't turn anything. No. Okay. No turning. No. So from here, this is forward. Okay. I would say outward too, in the golfing parlance. And I perceive it because I'm looking down here. I perceive it as upward as well. So it's forward, outward and upward. And I just keep it forward, outward and upward relative to me and just let the club turn it over. And I know that when the club turns that over, it's turned everything over. I know that anatomically without, regardless of what I feel, I know that intellectually, it's gonna turn me all the way over. Okay, so I don't have to, I don't have to get over here, John, and then come back. Mm. I never have to leave my crossroads. Yep. Fair enough? So I'm at my crossroads here. There we go. I can stay at this crossroads right here and just let the club turn me over. Twice, in fact. It'll turn me over one more time after I hit the ball. Okay. I can see it. Yeah. I can see it. Good. And for all of everyone, the fact that 
in, in a lot of instruction, we know that that there's there's so many times where we say we're going to do something, and clearly we don't do it. Right. Everything you're extolling, espousing, you're saying that you're doing, I can see it happening. Right. I can see the transformation. It's right. there. Yeah. And I and well, I can pick up the feeling of that. Again, I'm I'm saying it from a certain perspective, right? I'm saying it from the perspective, if you set up now, I'm saying what I'm doing from where you are now, right? Not what the camera sees from where you are now. Crossroads.